so ladies, yesterday, right, I have a client who called me and tell me her marketing agency, right, said that Reels cannot be remixed on Instagram, okay, and then it's copyrighted. I'm like, what? <sighs> okay, if that agency tells you this, right, it means that they don't know what they're doing, please sack them or terminate them, okay? So let me tell you about the updated Reels remix, okay? So this is what you do. You can follow Instagram creators. Later, I'll tell you where to follow, okay, and then where to find the information. So you create Reels, okay? Um, so creating reels, right, just got easier and more fun with features that let you remix in new ways. Their remix is you can stitch or you can duet just like TikTok, like that. Okay, can you see you can do stitches like this, like the remix top and bottom. So that means uh, the other creator that you remix with, their current original reels, let's say it's on top, you can actually put it bottom for your case. If you're featuring your own brand, right, or you can sequence means that you can stitch the, their current reels with your own style okay okay like this is their tips right you add your clips some ideas to get started stand out special add a new punchline to another creator's joke to keep their laughs going sort of like a game of telephone or flip a fashion trend like maybe you like this spin off from a creator and you want to show off your own unique personal style you can't use their image huh, guys but you can use you can stitch together like a sequence right you add to it and then you can add with your own video to show off your own unique personal style or your own collections let's say you're doing your own fashion style trend okay or you want to add your own verse or beat to another creator song so you can be very very creative guys so please follow Instagram creators, uh, TikTok, and even Adam Mossery, okay, the founder of Instagram, okay, you can please follow him because he always give a lot of updates on what's the latest trend. This is his IG updates, right? And then for those of you who are looking uh, for more support and advice right, on how to get the most out of Instagram, please make sure you follow their IG creators, um, Instagram creators, okay? So let me tell you more about the sequence availability, okay? So if the brand don't allow you to sequence, right, then they will, they will actually have a, uh, they will actually put their privacy, uh, button on that sequence not available, okay? Can you see that? If a brand hasn't allowed sequence usage, right, and you create a sequence using their content, Instagram may remove your sequence post. That means if you actually download their videos and then you stitch together with your own video and then you post it right then that's infringe uh, infringement and also copyright reserve all right so when a brand allows the sequence button right it means that they granted permission for users to create sequences using their content so obtain necessary permission means you must make sure that the brand actually allows the sequence button okay so that you, you they will ensure that you're not infringing other copyrights like uh, image, music, or this comply with Instagram guidelines. So Instagram will be the first one to tell you if you get a warning, like a, uh, like you have actually infringed someone's right. Instagram will actually tell you, okay, that you have infringed someone's right, and they actually automatically remove your content. All right. So for me as well, I uh I re <laughs> I actually got once in Instagram and once on TikTok, so I remove it. Okay. So guys. Um, yeah, so if your marketing agencies, right, is telling you that you can't do sequence, you can't do remix, right, please sack them or terminate them, okay, guys? So, and please follow me for more updates, right, on how to do your social media well, okay? Thank you so much for watching me. <laughs> Thank you so much for following me, and I'll see you all soon in my next video. <laughs>